Welcome to Thermal Experts in 5 Minutes by Kick. Automatic Systems Basic Functions. In this video, we will explain how Kick's automatic systems work. SMD lines often have inspection equipment that works in a very similar way to the Kick automatic systems, such as the AOI. When boards are inspected during production, they are compared with a golden board. Based on that comparison, the machine will determine if the board is in spec or not. In a certain way, we use this golden board to teach the machine which boards are acceptable or not. The Kick Automatic System uses the same concept as other inspection systems using a reference data we call a baseline profile. We use this baseline profile to teach the system how the oven should perform during production. The baseline profile is like any other thermal profile in which we will be attaching thermal couples to the product. But, in addition, we also record the oven process temperatures. Kick Automatic Systems measures real-time process values and will record the thermal process for each production board. The Kick Automatic System compares this real-time process measurement to the baseline profile. Any deviation affecting the process will result in new process values for each product. Any significant changes that will put the process out of spec could result in an alarm condition. This comparison between actual production board's results and the baseline profile is what we call a virtual profile, or VP. Virtual profile is achieved by using the following hardware. For temperature measurements, the Kick Automatic Systems use a set of thermal couple probes that are installed along the rails, covering the complete heating area and part of the cooling. A total of 30 thermal couples provides a resolution of two or more per zone. They are installed close enough to the product to provide high levels of accuracy and allows us to detect even the slightest change on the heat transfer to the product. The Kick Automatic System also uses a board sensor at the entrance of the oven to determine when the board entered the oven and to calculate the real-time process data. The Kick Automatic System uses a speed encoder sensor installed directly to the oven conveyor drive to continuously monitor the oven conveyor speed. The combination of these sensor inputs allows the Kick System to know precisely where the board is at all times and accurately measures and calculates real-time changes in the thermal process. Now that we understand the Automatic System's basic concept, it's time to run our baseline profile that we will use as a reference during production. From the main screen, click on the right column top button, the Run a Profile button. In the Product Name menu, you can select any product from the drop-down menu, or you can create a new one if you haven't run a profile for this product before. Kick always recommends that you give the same product name as the oven recipe. This will help the operator to select the same recipe in Kick software and in the oven during production. Now, select the appropriate process window as shown here in the video. This process window is user-defined and often comes from the product specifications, company process standards, or the solder paste data sheet. Kick will use its parameters and limits to control the production quality. After, select the application specific for that product. Since Kick systems can monitor multiple different applications, you should select the proper one to allow for the correct software logic to be applied. In the next step, shown here, just copy the oven speed and temperature set points that you will use for this recipe and click Next. The Kick system will need to be configured to match your current oven configuration. This can be done manually or in an automated process, just to navigate through the remaining screens following the prompted messages. Next, select the number of thermal couples you are using before running the profile, shown here. To start the profile, just click on the traffic light and once again follow the instructions showing up on the screen. Please note that it is important the oven temperatures are fully stabilized before running the profile. If you would like to know more about how to run a profile, please click on the link appearing on the screen and see our Basics of Profiling videos.
The Profile Explorer is where you will find all the manual profiles you have recorded, the virtual profile data, and all production history data run on this Kik automatic system. The Profile Explorer can be accessed from the main menu, middle button from the right column, as you see in the video. Please left mouse click on the Profile Explorer icon to access your profile and production history data. Here, all your data is sorted in different folders by product name and date, like you would find in Windows Explorer. Inside each product folder, you will find several events, the start and stop of every production, the alarms that occurred in each one of them, all the profiles for product, and the baseline profile that is used for the VP. The baseline profile will have the letters VP in green. That means that is the one that will be used as the basis for real-time process monitoring. The profile valid for virtual profile is always the latest one with a PWI lower than 90%. Now it's time to monitor our production. In this video example, we just performed a recipe changeover on the oven, and it's now indicating that it's ready to start production. We recommend for you to wait until the oven temperatures are stable to avoid any alarms on the Kik software. From the Profiler Explore menu, choose the product folder based on the recipe running in the oven and simply press Start. The Kik automatic system will now begin monitoring all production boards. After the production of this specific product is completed, just click Stop, as shown in the video. You are also able to print a report of this production. Repeat the same step for the next production and run once the oven changeover is complete. Thank you for watching this video. You are now a step closer to becoming a thermal process expert.